टूडेज टॉपिक इज सक्सेसिव डिफ्रेंसिएशन सो बेसिकली वट इज सक्सेसिव डिफ्रेंसिएशन इट इज अ प्रोसेस इट इज अ प्रोसेस ऑफ डिफ्रेंशिएटिंग ए फंक्शन डिफ्रेंशिएटिंग ए गिवन फंक्शन successively times so it is a process of differentiating a given function successively times and the results and the results of such differentiation or called successive derivatives so if we denote or we can say if we differentiate if we differentiate y a function y with respect to x we get first differential coefficient we get the first differential coefficient first differential coefficient denoted by dy by dx and this function dy by dx is a function of x so it can be again differentiated now again differentiating name it as equation number 1 again differentiating equation first with respect to x we get second differential coefficient we get second derivative or we can say second differential coefficient or second differential coefficient so we write it as d by dx of dy by dx this is equal to d2y by dx square similarly repeating this process again we find d3 y by dx square d3 y by dx cube similarly again differentiating uh, d3 y by dx cube with respect to x we get d fourth differentiation of d4 y dx4 that is we get the fourth order derivative so repeating this process up to n times we get nth derivative n times we get nth differentiation nth differentiation of a function of a function denoted by dny by dx n so the symbol used for first derivative or second order derivative or third order derivative or nth order derivative is so dy by dx is denoted by y1 y dash or y uh, y dash or d1y d1y or f dash x similarly d2y by dx square is denoted by y2 y double dash d2y 
or f double dash of x similarly these are basically the symbols or uh, notations for second derivative similarly for first derivative and we can write same thing for nth derivative so it is y n y nth derivative or d nth derivative of a function or f nth derivative of a function now so differentiating a function repeatedly is known as successive differentiation now we solve an example so first example find the fourth order derivative the find the fourth order derivative of a function of a function f of x is equal to x raised power 4 plus x cube plus 3x square plus 7x minus 1. So this is very simple example. So what we will do? Here we will again write here what is given f of x is given and f of x is equal to x raised power 4 x cube plus 3x square plus 7x minus 1. Name it as equation number 1. So what we have to do? We have to differentiate this equation number 1 with respect to x. So differentiating differentiating equation first with respect to x we get we get f dash of x is equal to 4x cube plus because we know this formula for nth function that is d by dx of x raised power n is basically n x raised power n minus 1. So we use this different derivative formula here. So that is x raised power 4. So we get 4x cube. Similarly, we know the differentiation of x cube is 3x square. Again, we get 6x plus 7. And we know the differentiation of constant is 0. So we don't write it. Name it equation second. Again, differentiating. Again, differentiating equation second with respect to x we get what we will get we get f double dash of x is equal to 3 for the 12 x squared plus 6x six plus 6 similarly repeating this process again differentiating name it equation third again differentiating this again differentiating equation third with respect to x we get we get f triple dash of x is equal to 24 x plus 6 now what we have to find we have to find the fourth order derivative so for fourth order derivative we again differentiate again differentiate equation number 4 with respect to x so we get f fourth derivative of x this is equal to 24 so this is the answer now we will solve one more question another example example second if y is equal to e raised power x sin x prove that prove that d2y by dx square this is equal to 2 e raised power x cos of x so what we have to prove we have to prove the second derivative is equal to this term so we so for this we will start like this here y is equal to e raised power sine of x name it equation first differentiating differentiating equation first with respect to x we get what we will get here we can use uv formula that is we uh, 
uh, we take this i am writing here take e raised power x u as u and take sin x as v so we know that uv formula is equal to first into differentiation of v and similarly plus v into differentiation of u so v into differentiation of u so now we will use so dy by dx this is equal to first term first is u so u into differentiation of v v is sin x so si differentiation of sin x is cos of x plus v that is sin of x into differentiation of u and we know that the differentiation of e raised power x is again e raised power x so from here take e raised power x as common we get cos of x plus sin of x so this name it as equation number second so dy by dx is equal to this term again differentiating equation second with respect to x we get we get d2y by dx square so this is equal to so again take this as u and this as v so here e raised power x into d by dx of second term that is cos of x into sin x plus sin x and then cos of x plus sin of x into d by dx of e raised power x so this is the basically way of writing for clearing your doubt so e raised power x now the differentiation of cos x is minus sin x similarly differentiation of cos x is sorry sin x is cos x plus cos of x plus sin of x into differentiation of e raised power x and we know that differentiation of e raised power x is e raised power x so taking e raised power x as common we have sin of x plus cos of x plus cos of x plus sin of x and here minus sin x and plus sin x get cancelled so we are left with cos of x plus cos of x and which is equal to 2 times e raised power x cos of x hence proved so this is the term what we have to prove thank you